Hello again. Today is Tuesday, August twenty ninth, twenty twenty three. I am back home. I'm sitting on, uh, uh, sitting at my desk, trying to read this article. Uh, this article is also from Border Buddy, a very renowned brokerage firm in Canada. So I'm sure they have some uh, know how or knowledge about trading and also about the statistics because they have been in the business for more than fifty years. And the、uh, second,、uh, the second generation, the founder's son is managing the firm, so uh, uh, it's not a big、uh, topic for the、uh, lay people or for small traders. But、uh, nonetheless, it could be、uh, quite informational about knowing better、uh, Canada as your partner. So let let's delve into dive into. What the statistics statistics say about the Canadian imports and exports? I am trying to read this article to practice English by、uh, reading it aloud. I'm not a native speaker, but I am Korean, and I I speak、uh, Korean, English, and Ch- a little bit of Chinese. I'm trying to learn Chinese. So,、uh, in six months' time, I would be quite.、Uh, Uh, multilingual with the three languages under my belt. So,、uh, and I would like to go overseas to and work for any、uh, foreign company, especially a company in Canada, the U- USA,、uh, Australia, or any other、uh, European countries where the English is clearly spoken.、Uh, but、uh, at the moment, I work for Korea Telecom.、Uh, I was with KT for、uh, close to thirty years. I Very proud of my company, but I still need to find a position where、uh, I can utilize my English to contribute more to my company's success, my company's adventure、uh, or venture into the world, which still needs to be、uh, polished. I think brushed up.、Uh, I'm I'm sure I'm. Uh, uh, Better, I'm a better employer, employee than other、uh, colleagues when it comes to speaking English. English, or when it comes to dealing with the foreign business,、uh, my company KT or Korea Telecom is the number one carrier in Korea, and I, I am very proud of my company. But I'm still looking out for any job opportunity where or position inside my KT where I could. Uh, I don't know. I could go global.、Uh, that's another story.、Uh, top Canada imports and exports and trading partners. Stephen Spencer, three years ago, Canada imports and exports more than five hundred billion dollars every year. Canada imports and exports millions of pounds of goods each and every year. In fact, is the thirteenth largest in. Import and export country in the world. That means Canada is brimming with exciting prospects for promising entrepreneurs like you to find a niche and create a lucrative import-export business. You might be wondering about Canada's top imports and exports, as well as their key trading partners. Perhaps you will be inspired. To choose one of these common imports or exports as your primary product, or maybe you will forego, forge a completely new path, or you will forge completely a new path. Are you struggling to write a business plan for your import and export business? Click here for our how to guide. Are you looking for an import export advisor to help you expand your business of exporting goods from Canada or importing goods into Canada for resale, for resale, for resale? Border Buddy offers solutions for businesses of all sizes. So give us a call today. Get in touch. That's a cliche. Give us a call today. You will forge a completely New path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path, or maybe you will forge a completely new path. 
Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Canada imports top categories: one, cars, twenty-eight billion dollars; two, car parts and accessories, twenty billion dollars USD; trucks, fifteen billion dollars; crude oil, fourteen billion dollars. Imports they. Uh, imports crude oil, even though they have oil in the sand. Processed petroleum oil, fourteen billion dollars. Phones, eleven billion dollars. Computers, nine billion dollars. Medications, eight billion dollars. Turbo jets, six billion dollars. Gold, six billion dollars. Overall, Canada's top import is cars. Not to mention car parts, car accessories, and trucks, which rank just below. It might seem overwhelming to import a product as large as a vehicle, but it's actually quite feasible. If you get all your ducks in a row, get your ducks in a row. If you get your shit in、uh, arranged, if you get the shit. Uh, what do you call get, get your shit, get your sh-、uh, shit, get your act、uh, together, right? Get all your ducks in a row. There's ample opportunity for new importers to break into the can- Canadian market and snag a piece of the automotive market share. Curious how COVID nineteen affects the process of importing car from U.S. to Canada? Read this article. Another huge import category is digital products, such as phones and computers. If you are interested in、uh, in importing digital products to Canada, you will need to carefully research the requirements, especially during COVID nineteen, including energy efficiency reports and labeling requirements. If you are a U.S. company or another company located. Located outside Canada, it's advisable to become a non-resident importer of record. Importer of record. Non-resident importer of record. Non-resident importer of record. Non-resident. Uh, non-resident importer of record. Find out all about how to become a non-resident. Importer in Canada here, Canada exports top categories. So it would be imports to Korea, for example, crude oil sixty eight billion dollars. What happened? They import crude oil, but they export more crude oil. Cars fourteen, a forty one billion dollars. Gold fifteen billion dollars. Plus, so obviously resale is going on strong. Processed petroleum oil, ah,、uh, twelve billion dollars. Car parts and accessories, eleven billion dollars USD. Petroleum gas, nine billion dollars. Medications, seven billion dollars. Aircraft and spacecraft, seven billion dollars. Turbo jets, six billion dollars. Sun wood, sun wood, yet sun, sun, saw, 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 sun. Sun wood six billion dollars. Cars are near the top of the list again, showing that Canada exports even more cars than it imports. Maybe you are wondering whether it's better for the business to import cars into Canada or to export cars from Canada. Thanks to NAFTA, both are duty free if the cars were manufactured in North America. But you will still need to pay goods and service tax (GST). Pay goods and service tax. Goods and service tax when importing to Canada, along with other potential taxes. The list of documents is a highly longer when exporting from Canada. However, do your research. Very cliche. Do your research and find out which kind of car import export business is ideal for you. 
Medications are also a growing sector of can Canadian imports. Because pre uh, prescription drugs are so much more expensive in the U.S. than Canada, Americans are eager to find a cheaper solution. Importing pharmaceuticals to the U.S. can be quite controversial, however, on the other hand, Canada worries their prescri uh, prescription drug supply might run out. Their prescription drug supply might run out. On the other hand, U.S. groups worry imported medications won't meet strict safety standards. If you are considering entering the pharmaceutical import-export industry, be aware of the complex regulations that need to be carefully followed. Complex regulations. Go here for more details about exporting prescription drugs from Canada. Canada's top five trading partners won United States $337 billion dollars was 75.4% of total Canadian exports. Hmm. China, $18 billion USD, 3.9% of total Canadian exports. United Kingdom, $15 billion or 3.3% of total Canadian exports. Japan, $9 billion or 2.1% of total Canadian exports. Mexico, $6 billion or 1.2% of total Canadian exports. I am surprised that Japan tops Mexico when it comes to uh, Canadian exports. I thought it got to be the other way around. The US and China are the top two importers as well as the top two exporters of Canadian goods. are the two uh, top two importers, right? Importers. Hmm. Uh, top importers as well as the top exporters of Canadian goods. It's important to note top two importers. It's important to note that the U.S. is Canada's most important trading partner mainly because of the heavily integrated supply chains between Ch Canada and the U.S. There is practically unlimited potential for trade between the two countries. Unlimited potential. Whether you are exporting goods from Canada or importing goods into Canada for resale, your business has the capacity to expand greatly if you offer desirable products. When it comes to China's relationship with Canada, it's marked by the huge amount of imports to Canada that are manufactured in China. It's marked by the huge amount of imports to Canada that are manufactured in China. If you become involved with importing from China to Canada, Make sure you find a reliable supplier and build a professional relationship with them. It's also important to select the right shipping method for your business model and correctly designate the in inco terms, right? Inco terms. Uh, there's a product uh, classification code system, right? Inco terms. For our top tips on importing from China to Canada, go here. Border birdie. Hmm. So from this article, we learned uh, such expressions as uh, inco terms, uh, a set of challenges that was from yesterday. Uh, probably um, oh, what else? What else I I forgot. Ah, let's go back. I'm sorry uh, for short memory on my part. Uh, lucrative import export business. Oh, you will probably you will forge a simple 
completely new path. Probably you will forge a completely new path. Probably you will forge forge a completely new path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Or maybe you will forge a completely new path. Maybe you will forge a completely new path. Business plan, border body. Businesses of all sizes, give us a call today. Trucks, crude oil, processed petroleum oil, phones, computers. Overall, this article, Canada find out. Canada exports, top carriers. Canada exports, Canada imports, top carriers. Canada's top five trading partners. Korea is not among the top five in good terms. So I'll go, go there and see if a non-resident importer, this article, a business plan right here. How to write a business plan for your import-export business. Start with executive summary. Keep it short and sweet. Business description. Conduct a market analysis. Summarize competitive analysis. Create a design and development plan. Don't forget the financial data. Carol's border, tips and tools. Vehicle import, border for the tips and tools. Vehicle import. Well, that's it. Thanks for listening. Take care. Bye-bye.